Villarreal missed the chance to open up a bigger gap in fourth place in the Primera Liga as they could only draw at home to Real Betis. Betis came to the El Madrigal Stadium after the sacking of Pepe Mel. A horrifying 4-0 cup defeat to local rival Sevilla and could have fallen behind after just one minute and 40 seconds. A lovely through ball picked up Roberto Soldado, but Soldado couldn't hit the target at the other end. Betis probably created more chances throughout the game, but Alphonse Areola had an excellent performance for Villarreal here, denying Ruben Castro with that save, and then Ruben trying to see if he could fool the referee Gonzalez Gonzalez by hitting the deck. Gonzalez Gonzalez said no. Played some nice football in the first half, Villarreal, and there Cedric Bacambu collects threaded pass from Roberto Soldado but curled his effort agonizingly wide of the post back at the other end Villarreal continued to look dangerous after this attack the ball finds the Betis youngster Fabian who once again draws a good save out of Areola Fabian preferred ahead of Dani Ceballos in the Betis starting 11 was still in the first half and once again Soldado looks to cross here doesn't actually get what he wants on the ball in the end Antonio Adan is forced into making a good fingertip save look Soldado's looking for Bacambo but in the end his cross nearly ends up in the back of the net we're in the second half now Soldado threads that one across looking for Jonathan Dos Santos whose effort was deflected wide for a corner Intelligent ball from Bruno Soriano, a good pass from Soldado, but Dos Santos couldn't provide the finish down at the other end. Good performance from Kadir in the Betis midfield, and there the Algerian number five saw his shot just wide as Ruben Castro couldn't quite stick out a foot. Indaye also tried his luck from distance. As Betis produced a much improved performance both in attack and in defence. As time started to run out, Villarreal turned on the pressure and the young fullback Alvaro Marin, who had a decent display, still only 18 years old, drawing good save there from Antonio Adan. But in the end, wasn't to be for either of the two sides. Villarreal have seen a chance wasted to open up space, but Betis take a well-earned, confidence-boosting point.